Hey everyone, Sponge Murphy here. How are you all getting on? So today I'm going to be doing an update for Idic Beer's Terrain Square Circle Competition. Uh, I haven't been able to get a lot done apart from the last couple of days, so uh, a good bit of an update. I think in the last video I kind of showed what I was wanting to do and the idea I had and everything. So I've kind of I've come to a, a near enough final decision what way I'm wanting everything to go on it. So first off, you have your the mountain cliff here, it's all stuck on it's built up i still have to get black spray to paint over and everything uh, and this is the final piece to go on top of it and as you can see i have the garden and more pieces on it just to kind of show like an entrance uh that'll fit on up there now and as i said i wanted water here with a bridge going across now i did want this to go a bit higher but then i think it would have been too big for storage purposes and that's wood like it's all floor it's it's pretty heavy so I didn't want to go any more than that and um, the bridge is near enough made all this is a um, I can't remember the name of it um, uh, it's kind of like the cardboardy wood I can't think of the name of it but um, it's all cut up into sections here I'm going to cut them out and do them as planks going across and uh, that's going to fit in there just nicely with the legs just blue tacked in so they'll all be set properly and everything when I'm ready to go um, <clears throat> so that should fit in there just nicely and there you have your bridge going across um, and then I'm going to build up the sides now this is just a small piece just to kind of put an edge on them even so that will kind of put like a proper edge proper sides on it and everything uh, there obviously I want to try and build them up a bit more um, now the idea what I wanted to have was this kind of cliff edge with a bridge and like a scenario going on top of it. I didn't want it to be all about the models, but I kind of feel like I had to have something going on. So I wanted to have like a like a like a battle scene or something like that. So I'm going to be using and originally I wanted a scaven, but I kind of come up with the high elves and something else, and I think this kind of fits it better. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a high I have a high elf prince on a. Or a high elf mage, I think it is on a horse. I haven't found the model yet, it's around somewhere. But I'm just going to be proxying with this reaver for now. It's pretty much close enough to being it. And so he's going to be kind of here, maybe just on the edge of the bridge a little bit. Um, there you go, you get a proper look here. And then he's going to be surrounded by other high elf sword masters. And these guys are going to be kind of going into battle with him. Uh, I had the banner guy here in the back. And you have the leader guy in the front there with him. So as if they're all ready to go into battle. Maybe they could do like a some more here on the edges or whatever. Um, and maybe even push him back a bit. Kind of put the horse guy further in front. Like that. So it kind of looks like a high elf charge. So it looks pretty decent. Um, so you have that. And then I wanted... Like I wanted Skaven coming across. But I kind of thought... Maybe if I had like a big centerpiece, it would look a lot nicer. Something that looks like a really big trace. So then I thought this guy, the Gorgon, that I painted a while ago. That I still have to make a banner for, by the way, which is still on my mind. Um, so I'm on him. Let's see if this will all fit in. Yeah. He's going to be coming across the bridge like that. Now he won't stay up because I had him blue tacked up for some pictures earlier, but not anymore. So I want him to kind of charge across the bridge like that. Uh, going to meet them in mid-action. So I think that'll look really nice. Now maybe I could do some scaven instead of him. I'm not really sure. That's why I'm kind of looking for feedback on this. Um, so I want him going across. Now, and that's not the only part. This is from uh, the Island of Blood kit. The High Elf Prince on the Griffin. There we go. Um. Now I wanted him flying in somewhere. Uh, I wanted him to come into the battle. Originally I wanted him here down along the water, but it's I forgot how big this model is. It's it's fucking its wings are massive. So what I'm gonna try and do is fix like none of these are gonna be on bases. I'm gonna take all the bases off. Uh, I'm gonna have this guy coming up here as if he's flying in like that. Oh I can't even see him up too high. But maybe up a little bit higher, about there. Uh, he's gonna be coming in to fly in. To help the the high elves like that. Or maybe I could have him coming in from the side like that to hit the Gorgon from the side. I haven't figured it out yet, so 
I only realised now when I dug him out how big he is, so I'm gonna have to find something to support him up. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it then. I just, for now the Gorgon is looking like that's the way it could be with him coming across, especially if I give him like a banner or a weapon or something like that. He could look more menacing, and um, you know. So um, let me know what you guys think. Um, I might do the next update video. I might just do with a couple of scaven guys coming across. Uh, it's just, just to see what it looks like with a leader guy. I could put the health pit on it. Uh, the only problem with the health pit is using this part to like walk across or on the so he's leaning on like a, a brick thing. So it might look a bit funny there. Although that does look. If I can zoom in. I know it's a bit sunny here, so it might be a little bit blurry from the distance. Let me see with the help it, I think it looks pretty cool. Maybe it could be the help it, I'm not sure. But uh, let me know what you guys think. I know the sun is making it a little bit blurry here. It's kind of, it's very bright shining into the window there. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, will I go Skaven or will I go Gorgon? I'm not too sure. Um, but the important part is that I get all this made up, I get the bridge done, I get the water done. Uh, the rest of it, the model part, I can, just, I can do at the end, that's fine. Uh, it's the terrain piece that I, that's important for now. And I have to work out how to do the water, which should be a good laugh. Uh, so let me know. Plus if I put the hell pit in, it kind of gives me a chance to put like some sneaky scaven coming around, you know. So uh, let me know what you guys think, make sure to leave a comment below. Hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next video.